one eternity later. Hello beautiful world and all who inhabit it, my name is Tim and it's time to talk about my Mustang. So I bought this car in May and it's currently pretty much the end of October and this car is just about being finished in terms of getting it running and running smoothly right about now. Even though I'm going to do a lot of parts and some story times and things like that, what's up? This is my roommate by the way. Hey man. He's single. Please, someone, keep him out of this room. He never leaves. <laughs> So, I, when I bought the car, I bought it with a bad transmission and a bad engine. Engine had a run knock, transmission shredded itself, basically. And I decided I want to swap it to a manual transmission, which was way more work than I ever would have thought, and put in a fresh working engine. So I did that, and thank you so much to my boy Frank of FJD Performance. He gave me so many weekends and so much help, so much time, and is still giving me advice and stuff to this day. I have to give a massive shout out to Frank for saving my life and making this all happen because he is the best and now now I have a car. Overall this has been a really fun project and let me go over what I did. One thing about this car is it's practically lived on a tow truck. It had to get towed back to my house when I bought it. It had to get towed to it had to get towed to the Ford dealership, back from the Ford dealership because of an alarm issue. It had to get towed when it blew an air conditioning line, that will be a whole other story. On the way down to SoCal, had to get towed over there. I had to get the car towed from the side of the highway to this tire shop when I blew the tire a few days ago. Another story. And overall, this car has just been a project, and it's practically lived on a tow truck. I'm gonna try to go over everything I've done with it so far because there's a lot and I have a list on my phone. I bought two different manual transmissions because the first one I put in turned out to be garbage and caused a lot of problems, another part of the story. I had to get new coolant hoses, new brakes, I ended up buying some rims for a hundred bucks for a guy off Craigslist, um, new clutch cable, uh, a couple of new co engine computers because of different wiring issues and things like that, uh, tires which were dumb expensive, coolant line for the air conditioning that I melted. Um, do, had to buy, there's been so much for this car, it's been insane. I had to buy new valve covers multiple times because they kept leaking, I've had to. One of the biggest things that I did that made a difference in the car is the convertible top. I bought it looking like this, super ugly, and the window you couldn't even see out the back, so I either had to drive with the top down or I eventually put a clear vinyl on it because it was so bad, and I cut it out with like an X-Acto knife. But thank you so much to Auto Tops Direct because they sent me out a brand new convertible top and it looks amazing. It's glass now instead of plastic, it has a little defroster, and it's absolutely incredible. I would have done a video for installation, but I ended up having to get it installed by a shop because I was about 500 miles away from the car for a little over a month and I wanted it ready to bring down here with me. On another note, I do want to recommend Auto Tops Direct because they did a really good job hooking me up with this top. They have really good prices for their tops, and I can tell they're super good quality. So go check their site out, links in the description if you want to make your convertible look a lot better. Another thing I did with the car to make it sound a lot better is I ended up getting some SLP exhaust. SLP loud mouth mufflers, and I'm hoping to put an X pipe on it soon to get the sound even more toned and hopefully get some backfire. And even though this is a super short version of the video and I'm going to do stories kind of one by one, of all the things that have gone incredibly wrong with the car in the process, my car is here and it's running and I'm hoping to do some crazy video stuff with it soon. So I hope you guys enjoyed this one. Make sure to subscribe, there will be a lot more videos on the Mustang. So, I'm filming a video. This is my other roommate, Ben. Are we seen him? No, this is just a video about the Mustang. Okay, the Mustang is pretty dope. Um, 10 out of 10 would not recommend. Because it keeps breaking. Yeah, it's broken. How many times now? Five? Oh, a lot more than that. Awesome. On that note, I hope you guys did this video and I'll catch you in the next one. Adios.